Hey everybody, Mr. Eric Jenkins coming at you with a brand new video series that I'm going to be trying out. This is called Tales from the Bargain Bin, where I'm going to be going over some games that I've acquired over the years or recently have picked up that are, you know, relatively inexpensive, used uh, shovelware games, ETC, ETC, um, that I think might be amusing for you guys to uh, watch and uh, enjoy with me. Uh, but here's one that we're not going to really enjoy too much. Uh, this is UFO's Rock of the Dead. Uh, this is, um, I played this for about 10 minutes when I purchased it a few years back for, I think, $2.95 plus Connecticut sales tax. Um, it is basically House of the Dead meets Guitar Hero. So if you've never played House of the Dead, it's an on-rail shooter where you have to take out the zombies. Makes sense. Light gun game. Uh, Guitar Hero never played it or rock band uh you get a highway as they call it with a bunch of notes you play it uh and it's a rhythm based game so let's put the two together and let's see what comes out of it uh with voice actors and actresses such as neil patrick harris felicia day and rob zombie giving their talents to this game by ufo interactive uh with a, a nice noticeable library of games i'm going to throw up on the screen uh, right about here, uh, some very popular ones, if you're not familiar with them. Um, you know, very, very good games. Also, one of my favorite games, I believe they also put out, Super Bowling from the Nintendo 64. So if you're into bowling and want to spend over $350 for a bowling game, be my guest. But we have Rock of the Dead, and I am looking at the cover. Uh, <laughs> IGN didn't give it a score, but they put, uh, why didn't anyone think of this before with no number? Normally, they'd put a number after it to kind of highlight the uh, how great the game is. So I played this for uh, about 20 minutes back in the day, maybe 10, 15 minutes. Uh, we are going to get into it. So I played a little bit, and I don't remember much of it. As you can see, I only got 11% complete. Uh, five of the 36 picks and five of the 36 datas. Whatever that means. Uh, shield and blast levels at one. So there's a little RPG elements here. Um, I did go in and mess around with some of the uh, options. Uh just so we don't uh, mess up. But um, I'm going to put it on normal. I'm not the best at these uh, rhythm-based games. Uh, hopefully, I did that correctly. Hopefully, it's not going to start from the original. We're going to start from the beginning. Here we go. So, we're actually going to back back it up. Nope, we are not. I already messed up. Look at that. So, we're well, actually going to have to back out of this. Out of the oh, oh spoiler alert, everybody. Spoiler alert. Oh, we are walking down the sewers. Oh, don't want to give too much away. Don't want to give too much away, so we're going to actually quit. Sorry about that, everybody. Um, I should have probably maybe wiped the save data, but it is what it is. So we're going to go into story mode. We're going to start back up here. You know, very primitive uh, 2010, 2008, 2010 graphics and 2010 gameplay. Uh, you can also play this game with your drummer if you uh, are in a band. I don't know how much fun that's going to be, but... um. Uh, yeah, so, uh, I'm not very good at rhythm-based games, but we're gonna give this one a whirly bird. We've got, uh, looks like a first-person view of an old man. Praise to the glory! Okay, so this next one is dedicated to the old dude in the front, my grandpa. It's called what the hell? Epic. That name needs work, okay. kid. I don't. I'm. I'm confused why this old man and me are hanging out in this graveyard together with a folding chair of all things. And uh, oh, one of those toys from KB Toys. They would have them in the bins up front. That just vibrate. That's all they do. That it just landed, and now a zombie is here. Okay. What is that? Whoa! What happened? Ooh. Must uh, be some music. crunchy, <laughs> crunchy sound effects there. Strum my guitar at what? I don't know. Aim at the bugs and play. You know, do your stop. You mean he called, <laughs> he called the the zombies bugs? <laughs> if that's what gets you going, then yeah. My music stops these creepy crawlies. Awesome. Awesome. The creepy crawlies. Oh, we have to use three fingers on this one. Now, it's it's it sucks. I got a blood blister from work. 
at your finger. Um, nice catch. I a uh, case closed on my hand, so like now I've uh, my uh, ring finger's got a nice little blood blisty. Now I can already see a problem with this uh, type of gameplay. Basically, uh, with House of the Dead or any other um, light gun shooter, you have the option. Oh, Baby Yoda! You see that Baby Yoda on the gravestone? Hopefully, we go back to it. It's like a, it looks like a Baby Yoda to me. So what I'm seeing, the issues I'm already seeing is there it is right there. Oh, I'm getting disconnected from Xbox Live. Well, that's a shame. Basically, what like with a light gun game, you can shoot to the left, shoot to the right. So if like if I'm playing with somebody, I can help them out. But I can see that uh, this game, it basically once you start strumming a highway, you can't go back to like the one that's closest to you. You have to finish that highway. So I already know I'm gonna get confused. This is gonna be a sh a crappy gameplay. So I'm uh, I apologize in advance. These, this is this is brilliant, and I'm sorry I don't have the music playing. I, I don't want Mr. Robert Zombie coming after me. Be like, but Rob, I really, I really. Oh shoot, he almost got me. See that? But Robert, I really love your music. And he's like, yeah, well a lot of people like my music, and they gonna get copyright strike. Like this, I got more. It's like, I really liked White Zombie, Rob. And it's like, well, <laughs> there's some people that don't like White Zombie. Me being one of them. Oh, no. Oh, I saved. Oh, I failed? How did. Those critters are totally attacking all our neighbors. Never liked them anyway. Those critters. I never liked them anyway. I never liked them anyway. Watch it. Might want to power up to create a shield against the damn things. A shield, too? I did not pay enough for this guitar. What the hell? <laughs> I have a shield now? Keep going. Keep going. You gotta get more power, kid. Enough amping. Use your blast on those mutated things. So I'm confused. So the, the, the old man knows nothing about music, but he's like, oh... But if you go to those weird KB Toys things, uh -oh. meteorites, you'll get power through your guitar. Mutants coming up the pathway there. Rocked it. Whoa. Whoa. Wasn't scared. Also, I apologize if you hear some strumming like through the microphone. This is like super rough. I'm actually in the process of getting the face cam ready for it. Um, so I, you know, this is just kind of like a, this is just a beta test and I'm, oh, I'm not paying attention. So just please bear with me. Hopefully the next few other games that I do are going to be a little bit better. And I had to itch my face. You would have saw that if the face came was there, but y'all don't need to see that. Ah, y'all don't nice. need to see that. The meteors are giving me some love. Okay, that Bearing sounds out. weird. Bearing. Our efforts to Oh, we got a weird, like, little screen coming up. Dude, what was that? <laughs> These sound effects are so awful. Oh, I got an achievement! Hold on. We must check the achievement. I completed 10 challenges. So I must have played this and probably failed a couple. Defeat the trailer Saurus boss. Whatever the heck. So I will say I did try to play this game. So a little peek behind the curtain. I failed to record this. So you'll see about trailer Saurus. Use shield with less than 25% health. Complete a level with 100% accuracy. I ain't, I am, I can tell you right now, I am not 100% completing this game on, with achievements. But I saw something about Rob Zombie, where was it? Find all the Rob Zombie pieces, that sounds kinky. 
Miss Moon Zombie might have to something to say about that. Ooh, hit that whammy. Ooh, there we go. You what you know about the whammy bar? Got it. Sweet. And the blue in there. Okay. A little pinky action. Freaking run, bro. There's a sh crap ton after you. See, now I I have to. I'm trying to get the one that's like right there. Done and done. Oh, I got a new high score on the level. Look at that. So that's the overture. We're going. That's the overture. Going on to level two. Seaside Park. A little Seaside Park action. Now, normally on a game like Man, a rhythm based game, I usually play hard. Whoa. I'm I, I'm I'm okay at rhythm based games, but like this, I just don't trust myself. I don't trust this game. And I don't trust myself, which I know is something my therapist always tells me. I have to trust others, but bro, I ain't trusting this shit. So we got a nice covered bridge coming, going through a nice covered bridge. Dude, just let me cross. Dude, why am I talking to me? Just let him cross, bro. Oh, you see? Oh, shoot. So weird. It's like, oh, hey, I, I nice just. Where I want to be. All right. Okay, so how did my grandpa make it here already? I walked probably a quarter mile down the road. Me in the head. Eh, not. And he's already got his lawn chair pitched up. Got a probably a brew going and a nice little uh, hamburger on the grill. And he's freaking just chilling. What are you waiting for, kid? Get those muties. Hopefully I get some comments that are like, you suck at these, this game. I'll be like, good, because this game sucks. <laughs> oh, now we have some actual zombies. Okay, so we're back to the dead aspect. It's not like Wreck-It Ralph, that game with uh, help, help that he like jumps into going, where he kills the side bugs. Oh, wait. All right, save now I got to save this person here, here, the ported potty. Take out that mutate attacking her. I'll just stay here. And see, I think the issue that this game... Oh, shoot. I think the oh, game that this... The no issue that this game has is there's, all, there's too many enemies on screen at once. And you, like I said, you get... You try and, like, get one... And you're not able to get the others. And you're locked up in that one screen. You're like, oh, there's one actually a little bit closer. It's faster. And you're like, oh, we got to finish the one you already started. Whereas a game like House of the Dead, you just freaking, you just lay into them. But I heard, like, somebody, I was telling someone, I'm like, I'm going to do a review on this game. And they're like, oh, just butt mash your way through. So I probably could. Like, these, you know, just be a little more, you know, just do the regular rhythm thing. Hit a little whammy there. Ooh, a little 11. And then you just kind of just, like, just button mash. So I kind of just, like, just shredded the little buckhead shredded there. Can anyone hear me? There's some sort of interference from the media shower. Mary Beth? What's she doing on the radio? I guess you're wondering what I'm doing here. Um, some rabbit animals sort of ate your regular recorder, so... Uh, Ooh, a little exposition there. A little breaking of the wall. Rabbit animals are running the street. Okay. So, uh, stay tuned for weather and more updates. Updates? Hey, I should call her and tell her about the power of rock. Better get back to my trailer. We thought to create The power of rock! Bam! Is this happening to everyone? Nice. Oh. 
man, why didn't anyone just rock out like this in those meteor movies? Oh, so I can't just button my wish. They, they gave me a poor. I, help me, I'm poor. Nailed it. I failed? And it nailed it. I failed and I nailed it. See, there's just too there's just too many of them on the screen. It just it there's if they had four enemies and I was able to get the four down. No. What is that? And how did he get here this quick? I went into a trailer and then he already fucking posted up shop. My grandpa's freaking useless. You got a responsibility, boy. All it he looks like a Call of Duty 2 character. Slouches like you to sit around and play guitar all day. Wait. And whoever has these trailers, they're like, they, oh, they got the the beachfront trailers. I don't know. Think my guitar could take all of them? Ooh, a very oh, close up on the Porta John. Whoa, when did this become a horror Whoa. movie? Oh, right, about five minutes ago. Now for a nap. I hope somebody makes a horror movie out of this where, like, the person has to, like, literally, def like, defend a trailer park with their guitar. Oh, I saved her. Because half of them ran towards me. See, that's okay. I would rather have that. Oh, what is happening? Oh, hell no. I am not fighting. It's the crawdad man. Uh, any chance we could call a TO? Rain delay? Anything? And I know, yes, a rhythm-based game should have music behind it, but... Like I said, I really don't want to get copyright strike. Ooh, and I'm getting beaten by the craw of that man. And they're not giving me, even giving me enough time to figure out what to actually hit. Oh, that's the challenging part, Eric. You gotta figure out what to actually hit. Yeah, but no. Dude, there's no way. I can't, and It's so far away, I can't even see it. This is just super strange. Like, I, I, why is it a giant crawdad? It's called Rock of the Dead, not Rock of the, uh, the, you know, crustaceans. Oh, oh, my dude's freaking choking me. You usually got to pay extra for that. Find picks to unlock new artworks. Go to extras menu for goodies. Okay, so I guess that's going to do it for this uh, this little level. Um, and I guess it's a good time to kind of, you know, conclude this episode. So thank you for checking this video out. If you like this type of stuff, please consider subscribing for future video game content as well as card opening videos. Leave a like down below if you enjoyed it. And let me know what you guys think of this very strange rhythm-based shooter game. Um... And stick around for, uh, you know, episode two will be out very soon. Um, I'm going to try and leave the link to the descriptions or make a playlist down below once I get this through. And like I said, it's a very rough uh, version of this. I'm trying to get the Elgato to work correctly and, you know, get a webcam going as well. So you guys can see my wonderful glowing face while I play these games. But right now we're just going to deal with the, the mic, uh, just the vocal aspect so I can annoy you and you don't have to look at me. But thank you for checking out this video. Like I said, leave a comment if you uh, with what you think about it. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe for future content. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.